Today in this video, I'm going to tell you what words this deaf person has trouble pronouncing, and I'm also going to tell you how I personally learn any new words. If that's something that you're curious about, stick around and find out. Hi, how are you? Welcome to another video. If this is your first time here, my name is Ricky and I am a deaf woman who talks about, well, deafness, disability, mental health, amongst other things. This video is inspired by a friend of mine, Jessica Kelgren fozar She just recently uploaded a video like this last week and I thought I've been wanting to do that as well, so why not do it now as some sort of response video? I also wanted to throw in my own personal experience as to how I learn new words because every deaf person is different. Some people learn through speech therapy and some have other little tips and tricks under their sleeve. For myself, I don't have really anybody around in person all the time to tell me and pronounce words to my face so I can try to like mimic their lip movements or feel their throat, things like that. What I do is I look up the spelling of certain words. Mo a lot of the times I just kind of guess uh, based on what the word looks like and uh, some of the times I'm right, sometimes I'm wrong. But I also will take, you know how when you find a word on Wikipedia or something and it tells you the way to pronounce it, they write out the pronunciation. I don't know what that's called if there's a certain word for it. But I take a look at that and that usually helps me out. I have started to forgotten if it's the umlauts or the long hyphen or whatever it is that tells you the difference between the long and the short vowels but I try. Occasionally I will also look up the actual sound so I will google how to pronounce insert word here stick my headphones in and then that'll sometimes help me sometimes it doesn't because there are certain tones of voices and just you know some things I simply cannot hear and that's usually when the whole looking up the visual part on how to say a word comes in or if I'm reading something out loud on say twitch I'll ask them to sort of spell out how you pronounce it, and you know, that works out fine. However, I can find a word that I know how to pronounce in my head, I'm pronouncing it without any issues whatsoever, or when I'm talking out loud to myself, I think that I'm saying it clearly. But when I play back a video, nope, doesn't, doesn't quite work that way. And one of those words, especially, is ask with a K. I noticed that when I play back my video and I say the word ass, it sounds like ass. Now, if I'm just saying ass with, you know, the three letters, I can get away with it, I think, because I try to put a little bit of emphasis in the K. But if I want to say, she asked her if she could do this thing, to me, it just sounds like I'm saying she asked her if she could do this thing. And I'm pretty sure when I play back the video, it's going to sound the exact same. So I try my best to put emphasis even when I'm saying it in that way. So she asked her if, but of course it sounds weird because you're kind of pausing yourself a little bit, I guess, to try to say it and it doesn't flow very well. But I'm just really trying to avoid saying she asked her because it sounds so strange. Another word I seem to have issue with is subtle. Is that how you say it? Because there's that B in the middle that keeps throwing me off. And when I would ask people to write how to pronounce it, people will say, well, the B is practically silent and you're just, and it's very faint. And you know, I, but like, is it subtle? Is it su su subtle, 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 subtle? Is it like S-U-T-T-L-E, subtle? Instead of with any sort of B sound, I don't, am I pronouncing it right? I've never known. Nobody has ever told me if I said it right. And it drives me not February. 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 I, I think there's actually a debate on this. There was a bit of a debate in Jessica's comments. Feb February, February. I even forget how to actually spell it because I keep thinking it's pronounced February instead of February. But some people say you need to pronounce the rary. Is that February. It's the same with like library, except I say library and not library. And I know Claudia kept yelling about lie, berry, 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 you know, to the point where you're thinking of Nathan going berry and misfits. So I can get library, but I can't get February, Feb, Feb, February. And two words that are similar to that, brewery and rule, 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 oh, rule, Bur brewery, Bur brewery, brewery. Brew, brew, er, eat. 
brewery. I feel like that's just one like blended word that's just has no actual how do you say it distinction between the sounds what what am i what am i saying brewery and a rural r ruler ruler rural 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 i don't i don't like these words i feel like mandarin was easier for me to speak and that has tones that i can't hear any other word i could think of is mansion is it mansion mansion i feel like part of me has always heard man chin c-h-e-n but then some people say mansion but i keep hearing mansion so i would say mansion instead of what it looks to be mansion and i don't know what it is now i know that there's a bunch of other words that i would have issues pronouncing but those are the main ones that i could think of right now if there comes a time when I'm trying to say a word and I know that I'm not going to be able to pronounce it clearly. I just try to think of a different word to say. So for example, if I'm tired of trying to put the emphasis in ass to avoid saying ass, I would say she questioned if she could do this thing or she wondered if she could do this thing because I feel like the combination of those letters and those words are easier for me to say. At the end of the day, I feel like when I hear my own voice out loud, like right here, not in playback of a video, but in real time, everything sounds clear to me. I sound high pitched and everything else, but obviously it doesn't come out that way in playback. <laughs> I imagine that words were much easier for me to say when I was younger because I grew up hearing, I guess, and then gradually my hearing started going but now it it is what it is I didn't take any speech therapy or anything like that because well it was never recommended to me and I guess just because I've always been speaking everybody's like you're really good at speaking and I'm like I, I, I know I've been doing it at the same time as you if they're you know the same age as me or if they're younger than me yeah I've been talking since before you were born you know that makes me that makes me sound like an old lady well you know back in my day I was doing this before you were born anyways if you are a fellow mostly oral deaf person like me and there are some words you know you have issues with or you just don't understand how the English language and pronouncing work or pronunciation works let me know in the comments I want to have a conversation about this and let me know if you took speech therapy or not. I kind of want to do a video about speech therapy, but have like a guest who can tell me how speech therapy is and what happens. Let me know if you'd be interested in that. I'll try to find somebody to come on the channel with me. If you would like to help translate this video, I will have a translation link down below in the description box. Thank you so much for taking time out of your day to watch this video, and I will see you later. Bye.